What's up, what's up, my YouTube friends? Hope you're doing fine out there. This is Metal Mixer, and welcome to the channel. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon so you don't miss any of my latest content. So, today's video is highly requested. It's how I change my guitar presets mid performance. It's very simple to do, and you can do it with any software. I'll be using Archetype Gojira for this demonstration because it's my go to amp sim and it fucking kicks ass. You can do this with any software you like. So, let's jump right in. So the way I do it is, I just automate FX's back and forth within the Reaper FX window. Let me show you. So right now I've loaded a song called Stars by Switchfoot. It's a surreal song and it's one of my favorites from this band. So I have already marked where I want my effects to change. And you can see right over here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So what I have done is, I have already made my presets. I'll be using three presets in this particular song. One is like heavy rhythm with a lot of gain. And one contains slightly less gain and one is completely clean. Just make the presets you like and just save it and then load it in another window like I have done here. One, two, three. So to open the automation lane, I just quick V. It by default shows us the volume automation, but right now we don't need it. So we'll be starting from this point. At this point, I need clean effects, which is third one in this chain. So what I'll do is I just click on this and then go to third effect, scroll down, scroll down and click on this second bypass option. Right now it's bypassed, so I'll put it on like this. Currently this effect is also going, so we don't need like two instances to be running at same time so we have to go back and bypass this one as well right now it's on we have to toggle it off make sure it lines perfectly like this so now you can see here as i'll pass this time on the timeline it will snap to this voila like that it's done and now at this part of time, I want the second FX to kick in. So we have to bypass this one first because we don't want two instances to be running simultaneously. Go to FX parameters, second FX on the FX channel. Keep scrolling and then bypass. Right now it's off. So control click here and now delete this one. Drag it to your marker. And boom, you have it. Okay, so let's keep going. Now here, I want my regular high gain patch to be activated. I can right click over here and click show all active track envelopes. So this is first, second and third. And right now it's on. Once again, we have to turn it off like this and turn it on. Control click, click, delete. Now I want a low gain effect here. Once again, bypass this one and turn this one on. Okay, so back to high gain now. Boom. And just like that, it's done. Now let me demonstrate it to you playing live. So that's it for today's video. I hope you find it useful and yeah, see you in the next one. Like always, 
Don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon. Cheers.